Someday Dad will get one of them what newfangled computers. Pain. I hope the flash didn't scare you, Max. This Gang. is a keeper. Welcome back to Hello. another episode of hey, honey. Life oh, I didn't know you is Strange. And, well, we're back. Where are my keys? And we must murder William. Aha! You can't hide from me forever. William. And no Chloe and Max wine tasting session. Dad. Don't blow it, because tonight your mother promised to make us a world famous salmon surprise with chocolate cake for dessert. Max. Ha! Ah, she ain't doing that. He's never leaving me. That makes all of us. <laughs> but. <laughs> Max, you are being so fucking strange. Like you're never gonna see us again. Chloe, I'm so sorry. I tried to make things different for you. <laughs> I, I did try. I'm sorry. She's like, what the fuck? What was she talking about? Talking about, but come on, you have made things different. Like my whole life. You're Why don't I be like William? Don't I ever got buy you Chloe a great car. Family? What's to be sorry for? We'll be best friends forever. And when we grow up, we're taking over the world. Listen, whatever happens, I want you to be strong. Even if you feel like I wasn't there for you. Because I will never abandon you, Chloe. <laughs> I'll always have your back. Always. Yo, is she gonna be like somewhat normal now? Because I said that to her? She's gonna remember that forever? Oh, it's back. And that one's gone. Replaced by this one. And this one. Replaced by David. New car. New knife. Wrecked car. Party time! <laughs> Wheelchair? Blue hair. Picture talking to her? But carrying something? <laughs> now. After that little detour, everything's back to normal. Or is it? Hmm? Fuck going on? Yo, what up, girl? Chloe, you're back. Oh yeah, now you suddenly want to kiss me? You had your chance. I'm just... I'm just I'm so glad you're here. Her roots are showing. You sound high, but thanks for the morning grope. Since we were up all night playing CSI Arcadia Bay, I was still spaced out here trying to put all this info together. Max, did yes. you forget we've gone over changed. this? Nothing changed. I hope you weren't messing around with time while I was sleeping. Not anymore. I'm just spaced <laughs> out too. Welcome back to the real world, Max. <sighs> I don't think I can ever tell Chloe about what happened. Now it's time for us to get copyright claimed by this song that I've never heard. That's my Chloe. The Bad Girl's Guide to Guns by Coffee Greer. Bird. Nice board. So close yet so far away. We have to do three main things. Right. Um, uh, what things? One, decipher Frank's logbook. 
to get Nathan's phone to find out where he's been during the mm -hmm. Vortex Club parties with Kate and Rachel. Ah, yes. And see whatever hidden shit he's got in his messages. Hmm. We can beat Step Douche Dan until he tells us about Frank, Nathan, and the Dark Room. Hmm. And I do have a gun now. Hmm. Keep it in your hands. <laughs> we'll have to do this on our own. You like these reactions, guys? Kick his ass, then rewind. <sighs> Fine, whatevs. It's your power. Which I can't waste on shit like that. Or Blackwell would be in big trouble. At least you let me take that money to pay Frank off. <sighs> Don't remind me. I just want him off your back. Our back. I know. You Red. should get busy in the garage to see what dirt you can dig up. I'm gonna cyber stalk some names and see where that leads. What's okay. Ahead? And be Bye. careful of step crack. He's not gonna be a happy camper after you reamed him yesterday and mom is giving him the boot. I'm on it, partner. I can't abuse this level of my re that snow doe always makes me think of William and Chloe. Okay. Let's examine this box again. See if there's anything so new. Sorry, William. It's not fair you had to die twice. Hmm. <laughs> True. Imagine dying more than once. Couldn't be me. There's Chloe's cash stash. Sorry, Principal Wells. I'm gonna take a picture of her. Yeet. <laughs> Trophy. Yes, Chloe Price was here. Getting lost in all this shit. Even Holmes and Watson didn't use every piece of information. How do you know that? Damn. This is a serious right exposé the Prescott's, of Prescott's pan. The Prescott's pan. Haven or hell? Whoa. Yeah, yeah. I don't give a fuck. I'm not reading that. I. You can pause it if you want and read it. The song's over. What's this? Coffee? Staying up mm. all night is the best excuse to drink lots of coffee. Shut up, bitch. I wish I could tell Chloe how much William cared about her. What's this? This butterfly photo seems like a million years ago. How much time have I altered since? Eh. Don't worry about it. Oh no. That poor little bird has been Blue trapped bird. in here. Bluebird, how has nobody seen it? Bluebird, hey, Bluebird, get out of here! Bluebird, Bluebird, hey, get out that fucking window! Oh no! Oh shit! I thought the window was open. Hey, Bluebird, Fly. got that fucking window. Hell yeah! And stay out. Saved your life more than once. Better be thankful to me. You better live me. Since David might be in there. I better mosey along for a change. Yeah, yeah. Let's go down the stairs. Let me see what's happening. Laggy ass game, what the fuck? Boy, he's not up the stairs in the bedroom. Yo, David, my guy. You won this battle, Max. <laughs> you broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you, ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Too late, isn't it? You just isn't it? better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. Oi, what? Well, are we gonna, are we gonna talk about that? What the fuck? I think you just fucking said that Chloe's responsible for Rachel Amber. Yep. Locked from the other side. Ooh. Yo, yo, Max, your friend Chloe texted me that she shot you down. Uh, you shot her down, I mean. That true? 
Chloe actually texted you? I sure didn't have her number. Oh, God. I don't want to embarrass you. Too late. She sounds cool. She's a cool dork like me. No, you're different in a good way. So we're still on the go, ape. No damn dirty human can stop me. Go, ape, not human. We shall see. I hope so. Now I have to get back to reality. That sucks. Indeed. Buzz you later. Ah, wait. I got more messages. Holy shit. Maxine, what the heck is going on with the weather up there? Are they doing military tests or something? Are you riding in the eye of a storm? No comment. I've kept Lisa alive through all this, so we're safe. As long as you're around. Talk now back to the books. Talk soon. XO Tomato. <laughs> we all miss you. And your bunny misses you. Because she said, I miss my bunny. Yeah, you're such a great friend. Thank you so much. Can't wait to see you. XO Tomato. Let's see. You know Frank Bowers? Drugs. That's it? Ask Nathan. He knows him, I think. Okay, I want to thank you for what? Yo, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Shada -da -da -da. <laughs> Sorry, my phone wasn't my bad. <laughs> what are you... Why? Are you doing your own investigation without my help? What the hell? Hold on. Oh! This is what I was messaging. I was messaging, uh... Shit. Hey, Julia, you busy? No time to be busy. You never text me. What's going on? Besides everything, I was just curious if you ever heard of a guy named Frank who lives in an RV around town. You mean a van? Down by the river? I heard he's a sketchy meth head. That's about it. Why? Are you doing your own investigation without my help? No, just bored. Talk soon. Thanks. Okay, but you can't see keep secrets from Ace Reporter Juliet Watson. Hello? <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Uh... She's got a weird text warning me that my nosy daughter better stop watching others and look out for herself. Is this some kind of school prank? And it's from a block number. Oh, I'm so sorry. Some jackass in my class thought that it would be funny to send. It's not. No, I like having strangers have my number, okay? Me neither. Sorry. I'm just being a dad now. This has been a tough week for you. It's almost over. I'll call you guys. I love you. Hey, girlfriend, let me know when you want to come by my room, but I'll give you a fashion makeover. Oh, thanks, Courtney. I'm slumped with homework right now, but I'll check in with you later. Thanks for the offer. Let's see. XXXOXO, and that was no emoji. I don't care about what else was said before that, though. I really do not anymore. What's this? Looks like David already booked a room. Yo, it's the travel money jar. Looks like they're back on the road to Paris. TV. Those Poor whales are like beached angels. What is going on here? So the whales are still there. Ouch. David, do not be here when I get back from work. I mean it. Ooh. To think this all started with my vision of a tornado. You can read that if you want to. There's a picture here. Joyce must be so upset. Are you helping anybody? Else? Yes, you are, Chloe. Buh, buh. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. Doubt it. Well, look though. There's the email here. Should I have signed the petition? From Raymond Wells to David Madsen, despite our rather heated discussion anymore. about the successful pitch and block a campus surveillance system, I'm still interested in your feedbacks on other methods of proving black hole security. We must find a middle ground between safety and privacy for our students. Best, Principal Wells. Wait, there's more here. Should I have signed? Oh, meow, Miss Grant. I didn't need Who's a surveillance camera to see the suspension coming. Best of luck to you, Mr. Grant. Mrs. Grant. At least he has one weird fan. Dear Mr. Madsen, I just want to let you know that it's bullshit what happened to you in this school has too many libtard metrosexuals who don't appreciate you or the military. I felt safe in my dorm when you were in charge, and I thought about you protecting me. Hope you will come back to Blackmel Blackwell and make sure we are all safe at night. I am scared of this school. I wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. From David Madsen and Raymond Wells, I apologize for my outburst yesterday in your office. I was upset about losing my position to Blackwell without a complete... Investigation of the facts and based solely on the claims of untrustworthy students. There is a cancer at Blackwell Academy, and without me, it will continue to spread. Sincerely, Madsen. 
these nuts. Surveillance cameras at Pan Estates? David must be working for the Prescotts too. Yeah, probably. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. I mean, she did. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. Whoa. What the hell did Mr. David Madsen, do for thank you for your help with Nathan. It's appreciated what best. Did his dad Sean do for Prescott. David? Oh, jeez. David is packing up wedding stuff too. There's more to David Madsen than meets the Joyce, guy. you know I'm not good at he explaining myself or why I act the Joyce. way I do sometimes. I only know that somebody has ever understood me the way you do. I would never do anything to hurt you or Chloe. Take care of my family is my number one mission. Yes, I overstepped my bounds with the surveillance and suspicion that I am, and I'm truly sorry and ashamed, but there are dark things happening in Arcadia Bay I never told you. You're my wife and partner, and I know that we should have no secrets, but I intended to tell you everything. But I wanted more proof. Instead, a student almost committed suicide on my watch. You kicked me out of my favorite home. What? Out of my favorite? You got another home? And my stepdaughter hates me. Please let me. Please let you what? <laughs> Bruh, please let me. Alright, what's over here then? Nothing. I don't see shit up in this piece. There is a locker. Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? These nuts. One, 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 two, one. Shit. Did for it. For once, I don't have time to search for the code. Oh, I need to find a way to break this padlock. Oh, look at the baby <gasps> bone tree eggs in the nest. I, I better move his plank if I want to take the shot. Excuse me. Just one I just want to take picture, a picture, please. Jesus. Click. Another photo from my Arcadia Bay wildlife series. Poggers! Let's move the plank back. Oh, thank you. Sleep tight, my eggy eggs. Don't know what that's, what that means, but okay. I don't know why that has consequences. All right, is there something in here that I can grab now? Crowbar. Okay, I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. You know better than Madsen. Uh, Max, Mad Maxon. Oh, that's right. I need to. Just, uh, use a crowbar. Sorry, David, but I bet you would do the same thing as me. True. So does that make you a good person, then? If you're on the likes of him? Oh, oh, what's this? Maps, notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh, yes. The fuck? <gasps> That's photos of me and shit. Score. Back to Chloe now. Not for I fucking go back in time with the fucking thing and put the padlock back on. I'm not stupid. Put the crowbar back down too. There we go. No? Get rid of that crowbar, goddammit. Get rid of the fucking crowbar! I don't want anybody to know that I was in here. What in the fuck? Alright, well, I just got a crowbar now. That's just something I have now. I tried. Oh, flyers, hello. I wonder if David is going to the party. I would doubt it. He's like a 40-year-old man. I don't think he's going to be uh, going to his teenager's party. 
It's amazing how much drama this living room has seen. Yo, Chloe! Are Yo. you ready yet? I have to get back to my dorm. Are we happy? Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel. Plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Yeah, he's now let's pretty get epic, the hell honestly. Out of here before we get busted. But I absolutely have to go see Kate in the hospital right now. I want to find out how she's doing. Okay. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby. Let's all go to the lobby of the hospital. All right, all right, all right. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. The hospitals always freak me out. I hear you. But imagine how Kate feels. I'm so glad I, I get to see her again. I hope it's not too weird for her. No, she'll be stoked to see you. Sad. Who wouldn't be? This be it. I'm a little This nervous. be it. Just go in there. There's a fly friend. on my microphone. Get the I'll fuck off. So you can chill by yourselves. Bitch. I was get the fuck off. Hey. I was blowing a fuse when <laughs> I answered Kate's call the other day. Good thing you ignored me. I had no yeah, idea what thing. shit she was going through. And you saved her. Like me. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. I know, I'm epic. Now can I please go talk to my Thanks, friend that almost Chloe. killed herself? But don't be sorry. We're all on the same team. Team Max. Let Kate know we're gonna string Nathan up by his balls then. <laughs> oh yes. <laughs> I'm on it. That would hurt. Let's all go to the room. Let's all go to her room. Let's all go to her room. Ugh. Oh, God. She's creepy looking. Max. She looks like a fucking who. Oh, Kate. I thought I'd never see you again. I feel so ridiculous. I'm so You look sorry. ridiculous, Kate, girlfriend. Listen to me. You have nothing to be sorry about. Other people do. Other people you do. You do not know how happy I am to see you. You look awesome. Is it a stupid question if I ask how you're doing? Now that you're here, I'm doing even better. I'm Epic. so grateful to you for coming up to the roof to talk me down. Max, I felt so lost and alone. When I saw, well, I saw you jump off that roof about seven trying, times, so. You made me realize I wasn't alone. Thank you. Kate, there are so many people who love you and want to help you. I know. You should see all the letters and postcards. I gave most of the flowers to other patients here because they need them more than me. I'm keeping them well. rooms, though. One of the nurses gave me some pen and paper so I could do some drawings. The fuck is that? I love your illustrations. They do you? They kind of dark there for a while, but... I have an idea for a new children's book about bullying. I was thinking of having some photographs in there, too. I hope that's a subtle hint that hmm. you'll let me take the photographs for the book. Was that subtle? You better take the pictures, Max. I'm going to be here for another day until my family comes out to visit. How are they treating you? Like they need to protect me forever. Huh. They're so upset, and I know they feel guilty even though they didn't do anything. They did, though. They kind of were like, yo, you're a fucking slut, girl. Daniel, Mr. Jefferson, even Victoria wrote me a very sweet note. And I believe she was being real. Me too. I'm glad you believe again, Kate. I'm working on it, <laughs> Yeah. Max. I'm a believer. I just pray I can get this drawing right. Not a inch of doubt in my mind. I'm in love. Thank you, sisters. You really saved Kate. I'm a believer. I couldn't leave her even if I tried. Dun, 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 dun. Principal Wells knows how to step it up when Dear he wants Kate, to. I just want to express my deepest wish for a speedy recovery for that the Blackwell Academy is united in prayers for your return. The students and faculty have organized a rally in your honor, and I have never seen such outpouring of academic and community support for any student in our history. None of my words may mean little giving your circumstances, but it's important, you know, that we do care. If you need any assistance at all, please do not hesitate to ask. Sincerely, Principal Wells. That is so sweet. 
Even Victoria signed. Hmm. <laughs> but not Nathan. Victoria Chase might be queen bitch, but... Kate, I know you hate me and you shouldn't, but I only want to see you smile again. Please let me know if you need anything. Exo Vic. What? Nothing? Oh, well, I don't know what the hell that was. Let's look at this book. Good to see that Kate is still <laughs> working on her book report. Yeah, it's really good to see that. Oh, I love Kate's happy rainbow flock. Where is she? Here. Kate, it is so good to hang out with you again. Mm -hmm. Max, I owe you so much. And I can tell you want to talk to me about something. Victoria. I saw Victoria's letter. How does that make you feel? Max, I know Victoria can be a... a not nice. <laughs> I do believe in forgiveness and redemption. I might be naive, but I feel her struggle. Mm -hmm. Me too. Solidarity, I could have taken girlfriend. I a picture of her covered in paint, but I didn't, and we had a genuine moment. We all have our moments. Why do you think she acts so mean? She's insecure. She's insecure. If you're comfortable with yourself, you don't need to act superior. Victoria doesn't look like she has much to be insecure about. If anybody could make Victoria see the light, it would be Kate Marsh. No, hm. I think it will take more than that, Max. I think it will take more than that, Max. I always want to talk to you. We missed our tea session this week. That was so not cool. We need to plan, like, a tea shop tour of Portland. Oh, yes. And you could bring Warren along, too. Warren? What do you think of uh, Warren? Oh, smart and silly. He's got such a good heart. And he's a cutie pie. You know he likes you. I'm going to the drive-in with him, so <laughs> we'll see. Yes, we will see. With everything that's going on, it, a date seems weird. No. We will see and we will like Kate it. Kate Marsh, matchmaker. I'm glad somebody is looking out for my love life. Even angels need angels, Max. Nathan. I want you to know I'm this close to getting all the info I need about Nathan. Nathan Prescott has to pay for what he did. And we have to stop him from hurting anybody else. I well, concur, Doctor. I did get his ass suspended, so... You got his ass might suspended? Be a start. What about you the rest did? of them? Oh, oh wait, oh, that is all of them. I love how fearless <laughs> you are. So what is going on with him now? Uh, the Prescott family, they'd I be think stinky. his family is totally protecting him. Or worse. I never say this about people, but Max, there's something evil about the Prescott. Evil! There's something to do with death. We're going to stop him. I just have to find Nathan's room number, get inside, and get the clues I need. Max, mm -hmm. please let me help. I can get the number and I'll text it to you, okay? Oh, yeah. Of course, Kate. I can't do this without you. Now it's time for Nathan to watch out for us. This is I poggers. have to get back to our uh, mission. You don't know how much it means to see you again. I do. That's why I love you, Max. Thanks for taking care of my bunny. No problem, oh, poor favor. Soon. Alice in Wonderland? If this gets Kate through the night... Jesus! Be... What if I told her I'm Jesus and I have superpowers? I'm Jesus. Those are nice I'm Jesus, flowers. I'm Jesus. And from Taylor? Wow, props to her. They're looking a little old. I don't think get well is quite apropos. <laughs> True. Get well. Get well from your suicidal thoughts, girlfriend. Woo! Alright, I'll see you later, girl. Well, how is she? She's still She's Kate epic. Marsh. Thank God. Let's get out of here. I'm glad we came to see her. We? Thanks for coming with me. Now let's go pay a visit to Nathan Prescott. That little oh. prick is not going to be glad when he sees us. No, he ain't. He's going to be so angry. He's going to be like... <laughs> and I'm going to be like, ha, you sound so stupid right now. 
Oh look, that's that's Angry Man. He made the Jefferson. Yeah, football, skateboarding, sitting under trees and drawing. That's what high school's about. Yeah. Sitting on the bench and talking. Lunchbox next to you and a tiki thing. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you going to Blackwell? I was way too cool for this. <laughs> yeah, school. you got it's blue hair. And actual files here. I can imagine. Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I Ugh. think there's too much going on in my life. On that note, Blackwell duty call. Yeah, okay. Remember, I just, I, I just fucking winner, stated like some suicidal shit right there. The there's too so much going on in my life, and he's yeah, like, no, "I'm sorry, you didn't." And on that note, it's Blackwell time. Understand your reasons. You can't force an artist to work. I feel like a total loser, but it's been a hard week to focus. No pun intended. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend, and I take mm -hmm. hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just. Get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. And nobody should hmm. have to see me dance. Plus, you don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. Be seeing you. Yes, you will. Well, she Top horny. Four teacher. Gross! <laughs> You're out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Mr. Jefferson. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that <laughs> is a great plan. Chloe Price. Are you Let's doing? Let's see if I can find out where you're going. Hey yo. Hit me with that shit. Hit me with that shit. Yo. Throw that shit. Yeah. Hey, oh, you ass. Yeah, I'll fucking, I'll fucking rock your shit, bruh. Enjoy the big game, Zachary. I hope it's not the last. You ass monkey. Let me play. That's so ironic that Warren asked Max to the drive-in. Hey, Brooke. How are you? I'm here as usual. By the way, thanks for helping Kate down. No problem. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sick of whales. I, I can't get my limited brain around that eclipse and the beached whales. I was hoping the science department had some ideas. Warren, <laughs> the science team is on the case. To compare notes and theories this weekend. That makes sense. That makes sense. Two big brains are better than one. Or mine. We'd get <laughs> the Nobel Prize if we could explain this phenomenon, but... Even Miss Grant has no clue. I know. Can't tell you though. Uh, we'll save Nathan for last. I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Really? I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone Aww. needs me. Let's go back. Now let's see what I can say to him. Whales. Warren. It's not like I don't own all the original apes, though. That makes sense. That makes sense. We'd get the note. Let's talk about Nathan. I need to find Nathan. Have you seen Because I can't talk to her about the drone. Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and Oh, fuck off. Come on, Brooke. Don't be that way. Nathan was suspended, but he should still be on campus. Warren's not good enough for you? Okay. I saw Nathan pissed and walking off campus earlier. Good luck getting that date, hmm. Max. You're being a bitch. I might feel better. Miss Grant. Really? You. Good. Nathan now is. Let's mine. go all the way back again. 
I should go back to Chloe. Hey. Hey, Brooke. I'm here. That's Max to the driver. Wales. I, I, it's not like I don't own all the original. That makes sense. That makes sense. We'd get the no. I all have right. to go. Talk later, Brooke. Now that there's not much tension. There's a little bit of tension, but like, it's kind of just between me and uh, myself. It's really just her, and I don't know. Really, I'm not supposed to know about another it. Another batch of dead birds today. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. Yes, Samuel. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. How are you? I'm sad so and man. confused, <laughs> like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. <laughs> you look like you Boy, have I love a lot this of guy. questions too. Uh, how about Arcadia Bay? I still have a million questions about what's happening to Arcadia Bay. That must be why Miss Gant says you're one of her favorite students at Blackwell. Gant? Uh, let's talk about... Uh, Rachel. I keep thinking that Rachel Amber has a few answers. If we can find her. If Rachel wants to be found. You think she's still alive? Do you think she's alive? She'll always be alive in our hearts. Sometimes that's all we have left. But... Max, <laughs> all I can tell you is to stay on your path and you'll find what you're what? looking for. What? Rachel Amber is waiting too. What? I'd rather be in her class than the Vortex Club. Yes, you would. Rachel saw right through them. She's not the only one. Nobody <laughs> should be trapped in the Vortex Club. Get out now, Max. While time is on your side. This guy knows something. Even though Miss Grant likes me, He's I like have Rain Man or something. science skills to explain that eclipse. As I was just saying to her, that's because science has no explanation. Well, no offense to Miss Grant here, but this is just the beginning. What? How do you know that? How, yeah, how do you I'm know? Genuinely curious. You just have to open oh, your eyes. Oh, he's like, I made this game. <laughs> you can see what's coming. That's why I can sense something bigger is coming to Arcadia Bay. What'd you say and about Max, black people? I don't like it at all. Let's talk about animals. I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Yeah, about them Bay. whales oh, and them birds. Many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. Let's talk about the beached whales. How can anybody explain all those poor beached whales? My dad was a fisherman. And he'd take me <laughs> I out love to hearing this guy talk. Sing. Now they... They just cry. <gasps> They're not alone. They're not alone these days. I feel so powerless. Oh no. You're the opposite of powerless, Max. True. You think so, Samuel? You and Arcadia Bay are connected by time and tide. So, next time I have a question, I'm coming to you. <gasps> this guy knows way too much. Let's talk about the dead birds. What do you think about all those dying birds? Samuel had to bury dozens near the Tabanga. Is that cool with the Tabanga? We'll find out if the souls of the bird move on. Not that we can prove it. It's so ominous. Unless it's fate. Then it doesn't matter. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see your squirrels are still healthy. Yeah. Healthy campus. Squirrels, squirrels, squirrels. If something happened to them, then you'd be dead oh. too. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The only thing that calms them is food. Lots of food, which reminds me th that I have to feed them now. Yo! <gasps> Sad. Makes me mad. Sorry yeah, I still to bother you again. Talk Samuel. to you about Nathan There's Prescott, no though. Here, Max. People. More questions than answers. Samuel is always here to I talk. need to talk to you about Ethan Prescott. Uh, but also, I want to talk to you about David. Do you ever talk with David Madison? <sighs> he talks to me. Because I want to hear this I guy listen. say everything. That's I love how David him. operates. 
He's so creepy. He sees things, not people. But I, I think he sees you, Max. <laughs> Why? Why do you say that? Because you both see with cameras. I think you have better vision than both of us. Oh, true. <laughs> no, Max. I, I just look at everything from a different angle. How about Kate? I actually just talked to Kate Marsh in the hospital. That's good. That's She's doing good. so much better. Because of you, Max. That was quite a rescue. Samuel, you're the eyes of Blackwell. Did you know Kate was being bullied? Of course. Most everyone makes fun of me. But Samuel warned them about Kate. I hate bullies, Max. I believe you. <laughs> Kate just needed some more helpful spirits like her friend Max. Hello. I, I hope she finds them now. He, he's so creepy. He knows way too much, but also he's just like suspended. kind hearted. You don't really sound sad. You don't sound sad, Samuel. Nathan hurts people. The end. What do you really know about him? Not enough to help you, Max. I truly wish I could. I see what you're doing. I'm sorry. I better get going now. Not <laughs> just like, all right, fuck you. Damn, shit. What the fuck? Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. Mm hmm I'm still bragging about you and the other students making Blackwell surveillance free. How about them recent events, girl? I was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. I can't if explain I could, none. I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in science today. I haven't been able to wrap my mind around that eclipse, <laughs> much less the snow in Wales. It's beyond science. I think this is beyond science. Nothing is beyond science except for our lack of knowledge. We may never know why, but that doesn't change reality. I, I don't know, I'm to time travel. <laughs> I feel like it's changing right in front of us. You and Samuel both. We were talking about that before you came over. Our planet is changing, but it's not mystic. It's erosion. Prophecy. So, you don't think this could be some kind of prophecy or something? Max, you know how fascinated I am <laughs> by Arcadia Bay legends. But I haven't found any apocalyptic signs yet. Unless you count those end of the world posters. Unless you know something I don't. I do. How about time travel? What about wormholes and chaos theory? They're like time travel stuff. The only wormholes in Arcadia Bay are underground. And chaos theory is just that. But if this is about <laughs> time travel, sign me up. Would you really change time? Not after reading that Bradbury story. A sound of thunder. Bradbury. <laughs> I won't give it away, but it involves dinosaurs and butterflies. Time is like a thread, Max. One tug and it all can unravel. Yeah, but it'll be all right. Surveillance would have helped Kate Marsh. Who needs surveillance when we have Maxine Caulfield? You did a yeah, I'm movie. epic. I'm and swagging. I'm bagging. Sure I'm tagging. Ow! Do you need to talk to a counselor? Nah, I'm good. Blackwell Academy needs the help. There's something oh, terrible yeah. going on here. You see it, right? This no. week hasn't been Blackwell's finest hour. Don't see anything. Sorry, and I am blind. some faculty members won't Are you fucking blind? All the students here feel safe. You're not seeing me. Not bullied. Kate was drugged at the Vortex Club party and bullied by them until she ended up on the roof. How do you stop that? Shut down that <laughs> damn Vortex what the fuck? Club for a start. I don't mean to get riled up, but that party should have been postponed. It's extremely tasteless given what happened with Kate. And she didn't even fight nobody. Do the Prescotts have anything to do with the Vortex Club? Other than Nathan they being like the leader of it? money from car washes. No, they don't. But membership has its privileges. Especially privileges. when your father is Blackwell's biggest sponsor. This elitist nonsense has no place here. You're right. I, I just wish this could be the school that I dreamed about before I came here. I hear you, Max. I love seeing you and Warren and all my students at your best here. Hmm. You're all too young to be so cynical. 
Nah, you don't know nothing about home. the young people, girl. I was looking for Nathan Prescott, and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. We aren't. Hell no. Sorry, Miss Grant. You're an adult. You can swear, damn it. And I'm glad <laughs> damn you it. did. So you haven't seen Nathan at all? Let's just say I try not to, Max. But I did catch him storming off campus. Okay. After what happened this week. I hope you don't see him either. You're not the best student here, but you you might be the wisest. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. Bye, Miss Grant. I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. Jesus Christ. Changing here. These As fucking scientist, people. They don't stop fucking talking. I'm just trying to get information out of them, and they go, hey, I'm gonna ask another question. Hey, Daniel. Daniel. You look bummed out. And also, I have, to, ta I have to give away every fucking well, then, talking point I because something may change. My photos basically suck. I may want to be an artist. I love your drawings. You're not here to be a photographer. That's my gig. Look at that sketch you did of me. Incredible. And that's your Maybe she owes me money, pay up, bitch. <sighs> I do feel better now. You are good, Max. Let's talk about the end of the world party. Are you you going, going? to the end of the world party tonight? It will be if I go, man. People here push me into lockers, not dance floors. Go to the party. That's exactly why you should go to that party. We have to stand up to these Blackwell bullies for Kate. You won't be alone, Daniel. Not with you to back me up, Max. Oh, damn it. I will go to the party like it is the yeah! end of the world. Okay, maybe I won't go, but... No, I won't <gasps> do that, but... I'll go. Yeah! Let's talk about Kate. Have you talked to anybody about what happened with Kate? I don't talk to anyone, Max. But I <laughs> did actually have a nice talk with Brooke. She couldn't stop talking about how brave you were on that roof. I don't think doing the right thing is brave, but I appreciate what she Lee. means. The most important thing is that Kate gets better and gets justice. Tell him, Batman. I hate that, Max. She's the sweetest, most genuine person I've ever met. I don't mind getting picked up. Oh my god, look at this fucking shirt. Hearts. What the hell? I just noticed team. that. I like this revolutionary Daniel DaCosta. What the fuck Only is that if I can shirt? Stop the revolution from my scotch <laughs> <next. laughs> My lady. He's way, got a my lady shirt on. Me? Oh, I heard a rumor he's actually suspended. What the fuck? Yeah, but he's still got to be on campus. That explains why he looked so pissed off when I saw him leaving campus a few moments ago. Right, everybody got the later. same story then. Okay, Daniel. I'm a liar. I'm a lover. Yo! Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. Because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. Way too much Chloe. shit going on, man. See you later, my Jim Jam. Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ugh, oh, <laughs> suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja Mode. Blackwell Ninja Mode? Lego Ninjago? Spin Jitsu? Alright. Well. What the fuck? Is that a map? That's a weird... Yo. It's so lame. Anyways. That's it for uh, this week's episode of... Life is Strange. That's what the game's called. Life is Strange. Uh... Thanks for watching. We'll be going into our dorms now to have sexy time next week's episode, so make sure to tune into that. Uh, thanks for liking. Like, please. Like the video. Commenting. Comment, please. Comment on the video. And subscribing. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And turning on notifications whenever you do subscribe so you can get notified whenever Life is Strange comes out next week or anything else that you would like to see, really, that I post. And also, uh, check the description thank you thank you truly thank you actually like i really do appreciate you watching these videos everybody that watches them bye T -H -A -K -Y -O -U. thank you 
Thank you. T H A N K Y O U. Thank you, gang.